Hearing new words this year? You're not alone. Politics is minting a fresh vocabulary. Words seemingly so new, you don't know what they mean. That's where this comes in. The humble dictionary. Post-truth, you've heard this a lot recently. The Oxford English Dictionary Word of the Year. Relating to or denoting circumstances in which objective facts are less influential in shaping public opinion than appeals to emotion and personal belief. And what about this? Nationalism, not so new, made popular in the 40s and 60s. And now in the new era of Trump's Make America Great Again and Brexit's Leave the EU and Take Control, it's on the rise again. A noun, a patriotic feeling, principles or efforts that in an extreme sense could be marked by a feeling of superiority over other countries. Then there's populism, that's become popular defined in the dictionary as support for the concerns of ordinary people. In today's world, it's become shorthand for anger at the establishment and the elite. Alt-right movement, heard that word? It's a far-right political movement rife with nationalist and anti-Semitic and racist ideologies. The term so trendy, it was shortlisted for word of the year, defined as an ideological grouping associated with extreme conservative or reactionary viewpoints, characterised by a rejection of mainstream viewpoints. It also refers to the use of online media to disseminate deliberately controversial content. Where would we be without this then? Memorise them, learn them. Chances are you'll be hearing them a lot next year.